Hello and welcome back to the Excel Tip videos. Today in this video, we will show you how to use our function in Excel. The Microsoft Excel hour function is a date and time function that returns the hour of a time value between 0 and 23. It is very useful when you are looking to get hour from a specified time value and it returns the value error when any invalid serial number is supplied in the argument. Let's see how our function works in Excel with the help of examples. We have taken few dummy time values in column A to extract hours from it in column B. Okay. Now we go to cell B9 and enter equal to followed by our function. As we type our function, we can see the description and it says return the hour as a number from 0 which is 12 am to 23 that represent 11 pm. Now we hit tab to autocomplete as you can see. The function takes only single argument that is serial number. It is the time value from which you want to extract the hour component. It can be entered as decimal number, a string value or the time value returned from another Excel formula. Alright, now we take a 9 which has time value and hit enter. The moment we hit enter, function gives us 2 as the hour value. So the function has skipped minutes and seconds and only extracted hour from it and return. In the next example we take a 10 and hit enter. But this time function returned 0 as the result. But why? That is because value 0 represent 12 am and 23 represent 11 pm. And that is why in this case function returned 0 as the answer. In the next example, we will directly supply the time value in the function and we'll see what function would return to. So we enter our function in cell B11 and hit tab to to complete. In double quotes, we type 1 hour 5 minutes 0 second and then we close the parenthesis and hit enter. And here we go. Function returns 1 as a result. As we mentioned earlier, you can take the string or text value to that represent Excel time. Now we move on to the next example and before we enter function in cell B12, we can see this time there is a date and timestamp in cell A12. Anyways, we type our function sorry, and take A12 and hit enter. As soon as we hit enter, function extracts and return our portion of the date and time value which is 21 in this case as a result. So the dates are ignored and we have successfully extracted our from the date and time value too. But what happens when there is an integer value in the cell? What our function would return to? As we know that in Excel dates are stored based on serial number of the date and times are stored as decimal numbers between 0 and 1. And as you can see in cell A13, an integer where the decimal part of the integer represents the time and it is in the format which is not readable. So we don't know what 0.49149 represents. But you can format the cell according to the format you are looking for. Anyways, now we move back to cell B13 and we type our function and take A13 and hit enter. And same like before, this time also function only looked out for the decimal part and extracted only hours from the integer which is 11 in this case. All right. In the next example, we can see that we have a decimal value 0.225 which represents 5 hours 24 minutes. So when we take this in our argument and execute, function returns. 5 as the answer in cell B14. Now we move on to the next example and we take A15 which shows 11 which is entered as text string. So let's see what function would return. We close the parenthesis and hit enter. The moment we hit enter, function returned as 11. But we haven't specified the time as am or pm. Then how function returned as 11. That is because as we mentioned in the beginning, function accepts time as text string to and as the hour function 
return based on the 24 hour clock system and the number 11 as our represent time before noon. In the next example, we have 39 hours 15 minutes 23 seconds in cell A16. So, we take this as argument in cell B16 and close the parenthesis and hit enter. The moment we hit enter, function returns 15 as the hour value. But how is it calculated? That is because if you look at the time shown in cell A16, it is actually an entire day plus time 15 hours 15 minutes 23 seconds. Therefore, when we supplied this value in the argument, the function ignores the whole day and simply returns the hour value 15 in cell B16. Now we type our function again in B17 and we take A17 in the argument and close the parenthesis. As soon as we hit enter, function gives us 0 as the output because date with no time value is considered as 12 am which is represented by 0 hour. Hence, the function return 0 as the output. In the next example, you can see that we can also nest now function inside our function to return the current hour value in the cell. So, we enter our function in cell B18 and then we type now function and hit tab to auto complete and we close the parenthesis since now function does not take any argument and once again we close the parenthesis for our function and hit enter and here you go. The function returned with the current hour value. Now we move on to the last example and we enter our function in B19 and hit tab to auto complete and this time we take A19 which has some text in it and then we hit enter and this time function returns value error that is because excel does not recognize the supplied argument as valid excel time and hence function return an error value well this is how you can use our function to extract our from different kind of time formats if you like this video don't forget to click on subscribe button to get regular updates and feel free to share this video tutorial with your friends as well that's all for now we hope you found this lesson informative we shall meet again in our next lesson. Till then, happy learning and have a nice day. Thank you.